So this is episode 23 of our journey to beat Roblox Bed Wars. And the new objective of the series is to get level 55 within the battle pass. And in the last episode, we finally reached level 50. So to start off today's episode, as always, we need to go ahead and buy our AFK crates. Will today be the lucky day where we get a random free kit? I think we're just never gonna get a free kit. This is why my dreams are gonna stay dreams forever. Good things come to those who wait. But I've been waiting for too long. Down to our last AFK crate. Is it gonna give us anything else but Battle Pass XP? And we need 53,000 XP just to level up once. So we're just gonna try and complete 16 of the eggs to get the kid skin. That seems to be the only decent reward. We can now use Talia, Metal Detector, Builder, and Hannah. Let's put on our flying broom and just go collect all of the lobby eggs. There's two carrots, third carrot, deliver them to the rabbit, and we have found the lost egg. Now we just come over to this windmill, knock five times, and now we've collected the hidden egg. All right, I just joined a random custom match for a creative egg. So now we just need to get into a match and try and complete as many of these as possible. And doing the weekly missions will give us a solid 24,000 XP, which is gonna give us a guarantee level up unlocking a lucky crate. So for the first match, we're gonna use Hannah Kit. We don't need to do the egg hunt challenge because we don't get any rewards for Bed Wars. That is just for the Roblox event, which I'm gonna be doing on live stream. So if you don't wanna miss out and you want a chance of getting the golden headphones, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe with notifications on. All right, let's hop into our first match and try and crack out as many challenges as we can. Oh, well, there's the sword egg. All right, we've now bought the emerald egg. Yeah, I don't know what I'm meant to do with this now. I'm just running around with an egg. You found the diamond egg. All right, I don't want to break any beds until the end because we need to try and survive 29 minutes for the survivor egg. Let's kill this metal detector real quick. He only had two M's? Just fireballing someone into the void count? Well, I'm sure we're about to find out. Okay, there we go. We got the void egg. All right, let's go take this back to base and that should be an egg. You found the golden egg. What is with these bridges? Something tells me that the building bridges are not very useful. All right, let's get the flying TNT. You found the flying TNT egg. Do they have a tier three gen? All right, let me just uh, let me just join the diamonds. I'm just wondering if we're actually going to survive the 29 minutes. To be honest, that's why I'm wondering the most. <laughs> Well, I mean, that would have been the void egg right there, but we already got it. I'm going to start personal chesting all of my emeralds. Um. All right, we found the enchantment egg. I've also got to remember to break the bed before beds break, because usually I just forget. You guys know me. I like my 29-minute matches, so that egg is perfect for me. I knew he wouldn't be able to run away forever. They always get stuck on something. We can't get the party egg right now because we don't have the emotes. This guy's so low to the boss. We have plenty of emeralds. That should be a headhunter. Let's see if we can get a good enchantment for it. <laughs> I mean, that works too. We found the sniper egg. My builder teammates disappeared, but whoever he was literally just saved my bed. They really want that bed break. I mean, I'd let them get it, but they can wait till the last minute like me. All right, we got the titan egg. All right, all beds are about to break, so we got to go now. This guy's alpha blood. I guess they don't want that 29-minute survival badge. Let's hope we don't get suffocated. <laughs> I just boxed him in. Wait, can you even survive 29 minutes on this game mode? We're already at 23 minutes, and the entire map is already destroyed. The entire map is gone. <laughs> we have five minutes to spare with this creature. Four minutes to go with this guy. He's trying so hard to get up to kill me. It is not working out. <laughs> He's trying to mine up. <laughs> he might not know it yet, but he'll be thanking me once we hit that 29 minute mark. He's like, oh, that's what you meant, Bo. Oh. Five seconds to go. There's no way. Imagine if he knocked me off right at the last second. Okay, we just got the survivor egg. See, you're welcome. He got the egg also. All right, so we've unlocked the golden goose dance, which we need to equip. And we just need two more eggs to unlock the kid skin, which we can do by doing the party egg and winning 30 versus 30. But for 30 versus 30, we're going to be using metal detector. All right, let's hop into 30 versus 30. No pun intended. Now, <laughs> oh, the out plays, boys. The out plays. Let's hop towards this diamond generator. Yeah, he didn't want any of that, bro. He got comboed so bad, he started running the opposite direction. This game mode is just complete chaos. You just don't even know what's going on. Too many players, 
too many kids. But the biggest one of them all is there's too many teammates. We all know how it goes when it comes to my teammates on these modes. We just got to make sure we don't put our diamonds in the team crate. Otherwise, those diamonds will disappear in seconds. Bio's a tier 2 gen. This game mode is hard work. This feels like an actual real-life job. Well, technically, this is my job. Never mind. When people are going to ask me what job I do, I'm a 9 to 5 metal detector. They just don't need to know that it's in Bed Wars. You know how sore my back is from carrying 29 other players? Hey, <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right, there we go. There's a large egg. <laughs> All right, so now we've done 16 eggs unlocking the Tilia kit skin. And there's no point in me doing two more just for a title. And Tilia kit is a free kit of the week. And now we can put on the Easter Tilia kit. And our next one is going to be at level 55 if we can complete it within the next two weeks. Don't all rush at once to come get the generators with me. And we actually got like the perfect map because these guys are battling it out. And we just got 12 diamonds. Now we can start buying and selling and investing. Well, they can handle that while I go get all the guards. Oh, this guy thinks he's going to go and get that emerald. Yeah, deal with that then. Yo, it really is Messi because he's outrunning that chicken. I still don't get the point of these bridges. I can't lie. For a couple of chickens to go over there. While they're distracted on the chickens, they're not going to get my bed. And they're also going to kill their entire team. <laughs> I'm just waiting at base until the price changes because I am not spending one emerald each for a chicken. I'm sure 50 chickens will be enough. I'm tired of their fireballs. I am not letting them fireball my farm. I think we have enough chickens to survive for the very last second. May as well throw the void chickens at each base just to see how much damage they're doing. They're doing plenty of damage. I guess one layer of obsidian doesn't do the trick after all. You can just throw all the chickens in and then you can just break the bed, which I need to do for my missions. All right, next bed, done. Wait, I may as well go and enchant them. I guess I don't need to enchant them, but I'm going to anyways. Is that a duck or a chicken? I have no idea. I don't care what they are. They can just go finish the match for me. <laughs> All right, I actually need to go to use the bathroom. So I'm just going to place these here and uh, I'll be right back. Hopefully they can protect me. I'm not even trolling. I'll be back. Oh, what happened? They could have at least killed the boss while I was gone. You know what I'm saying? Why is there an invisible player behind me? I don't know what he's trying to do exactly, but it's not going to work out for him. I think he was going for that Titan egg. <laughs> he just risked his entire life for that Titan egg. Oh, perfect. I can sell them for some emeralds and buy 200 and... Oh, but at least we got Battle Pass level 51. You guys move out the way. I'm trying to open some lucky crates. Get out the way. Move out the way. Okay, let's see what we get. Uh, is that a lobby gadget? Aren't you meant to have two? Because this just looks stupid. All right, the next kit is the builder kit. But at least we spawn with some stone. I built a scaffold that my teammates could probably just break. Oh, oh, oh yeah. And, and then, yeah, my teammates break it anyways. I don't know why I don't see more people bed defending. It's the easiest role of the team. You just sit at base and put blocks down. That's it. No one ain't getting past my bed. I hate this so much. Like, my OCD is killing me. You know what I mean? It won't let me place the block right there. That is so annoying. Like, how annoying is that? Yeah, they're basically just for trolling, I guess. I don't even know. I don't sabotage teammates anymore. Yeah, this is one way of not letting enemies' beds get destroyed. I should have been a builder main two years ago. Uh, this looks so obvious. <laughs> you can't even hide it. If you could put carpets above it, it would be fine. It didn't work. I literally just pressed it and it didn't work. Now we need to go show them why they should have had a builder. This is not going to look pretty for you guys. Oh, they're going for the bed. Who put that hole there? Because it wasn't me. I mean, just a little tip. You can't blow up ceramic. Especially reinforced ceramic. Why does this always happen when I have a kid skin on? Anyways, I do not have time to grind out 100,000 XP. So maybe in the next episode, we can use Terrakit. So if you guys have got any good XP methods involving Terrakit, then let me know in the comments. If you're new to the series or missed any episodes, here's a series playlist to keep up to date.